Okay, so we've got a 20 minute, 5 second game, and yet again, they're blitzing out the moves. Let's develop the knight here. Let's push this pawn. X-ray through to the king, making space for castling. Let's castle. Shall we attack the knight? Do we lose out? This is where you can get a bit fancy, into it? You go here like this. But they do take the knight. If you take the bishop, then the knight takes the um, bishop. So you, that's kind of a... I've seen that loads of times in many games. You know, they jump in and then they lose out tempo-wise because it looks juicy. It only works when the bishop's not already out and then you jump here with the knight. Because then the knight can't take it back because he's got the x-ray through to the king. So we're going to avoid doing that. We could go here. Smaller piece attacking the higher piece. The knight still can move, obviously. Uh, pawn can take. Then we've got rook check and stuff. So I think that one looks a little bit more annoying. So I'm going to push this pawn. So they do take. So our knight can take. Or we can put the check on the king. I'm going to take first. If the knight does take, then the queen's getting a little bit active, isn't it? Let's get up there. So hopefully it's giving them things to think about early doors of the game in the opening. So it's going ready for castling. Can we bring the knight in now and attack? Queen's defending the bishop, so if the knight does take, the queen can take. Or do we develop the dark square bishop? I feel like I'm wanting to just keep the momentum going. So I'm going to attack the knight. And capture. Still protecting. If the bishop takes, we do get a momentary check on the king. So let's capture. Obviously the pawn is going to drop. I'm going to capture the pawn. With the queen. Yep. And we don't really want to leave the queen there, but I want to also get my bishop out, get the rook facing the queen if we can, but I think we're a bit late to the party, so the rook's going to come and challenge. Might even be the queen. We do have a 2 on 1 here, but not too interested in that because the queen is going to they're going to win the rook pawn here when the rook comes across we have to move out of the way we we'll take another pawn or whichever pawn but we'd have to be careful because they can still get around the back towards our king so they've slowed down now i'm hoping that they're too late to the party They've actually pushed the pawn, which is, I suppose, okay. It's protecting the pawn. Don't want any more pawns taken. It's blocking the diagonal. Uh, so, does that give us time to attack their... 1, 2, 3, 4, attack their queen. And maybe try and own this file with the rook. It's all maybe, I'm not too sure. They're gonna... They could have a blinding move somewhere. So we have plenty of time, don't have to move this quick at all. So they are now moving slow. Okay, so the queen has moved off of the line. And if we brought this rook here, then we could potentially do this because then the bishop's not going to take. But is that just too slow? I don't think I'm in a rush. Although really, I should be in a rush, shouldn't I? Because... The rook is going to come and they're going to win a pawn. So I don't want to give them a pawn for free. So I think we'll do this. And we can consider that if the position is still the same. But I do believe the rook is going to come now. Although he's probably thinking, I don't want to lose a pawn. Okay, so he's not going for that. He's supporting. So let's give this a try. And then he's defending the pawn, but... Ah, it's moved out of the way. But really, we could actually take 
the pawn, couldn't we? Because we have the discovery check on the queen. And we'll be on their rook as well. But it's all a matter of where the queen is going to go. I think we can take the pawn with this discovery check on the higher piece. Just go for an exchange with the queen. So if we take this, then his rook takes, and then the bishop takes their rook, then they're not going to have many pieces left, are they? Let's take. And take. Can't go there because his rook is there defending. So he does actually have, he's half decent really. He's got a bishop and a rook, you know, so we're not actually winning. Is actually pressing onto our pawn as well. Yes, yeah, so they can still win actually. Let's just push this pawn here. I thought he was going to have less pieces, but he doesn't. Well, he's got less pawns. We're plus four at the minute. So we have to box clever. Just really take time now and find hopefully some half decent position. Well, it looks like they've left again. Maybe we don't have to. Okay, we'll claim victory on that. Interesting game.